accept me. Please accept me. Please accept me. Please. Oh, hi. My name is Aiden Man, and today you're watching my college decision reaction video. Except with each decision, the video gets more cursed. <laughs> I live in the Bay Area, and I applied to 20 colleges in total. And before you ask, no, I am not making a stats video. These types of videos can get incredibly toxic, and people tend to compare themselves. So please do not compare on this video. I'm not releasing my stats, and just use this for entertainment purposes only. I hope you enjoy. What's going on, guys? It is uh, currently about 1 p.m. I'm with my mom and my dad, and we're about to open this decision. So first of all, <laughs> logging in, okay. Turn this way. Logging in. Oh my god. Okay. Decision. I was denied. No, you weren't. No, you weren't. Yeah. Seriously, babe? Yeah. Really? Yeah. What's going on, guys? It's December the 19th. I'm with my mom again, and I'm about to open the UMass Amherst application. First, we gotta sign in. You update. Let's go! I got it! Dude, you know, I'm going to college! I'm going to college! I'm going to college! So I actually just read it again, and it turns out I got $16,000 per year with the Chancellor Award. So um, that's kind of a, a W right there. Down in Ohio, swag like Ohio. What's going on, guys? It's December 21st, and Case Western just came out. Oh, boy. So just uh, logging in. You update. I guess I'm gonna be down in, in Ohio, Ohio, swag like Ohio. Down in Ohio, swag like Ohio. Guys, oh my God, I just got forty three point five thousand dollars per year. <laughs> Bro, what? <laughs> this is gonna be a Boston moment. What's going on, guys? It's January thirtieth, and Northeastern just came out. Oh boy. Okay. Ah, uh, got deferred. It's whatever. It's deferred. It is what it is. It is what it is. <laughs> it's Yukon time. Whoa, whoa. What's going on, guys? It's February 25th, and we're about to open up University of Connecticut. So let's go. The update. Let's go. Let's go. Chocolate, 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 chocolate chip. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate chip. Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate chip. Chocolate, chocolate chip. Mr. President, what did you do? Chocolate, chocolate chip. Oh, yeah. Chocolate chip. What is your message to Republicans who are prepared to block the January 6th commission? Let them enjoy Eat some chocolate, chocolate, chocolate chip. Yeah. What's up, guys? This is Editing Aiden. So, I just found out that Joe Biden isn't actually from Connecticut, so... This joke makes no sense. Oh, guys, so they also said that I got 23K per year, which has 92 in total. So that's a, that's, a, that's a W right there. We like that. We like that. Also got into their honors college. So W's all around. What's going on, guys? It's March 7th. Let's go. Right now, oh, I'm nice. with a few people yeah. in economics yeah. class. Oh shoot, UNH time. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, let's check, let's check, let's see. Okay. No, that sucks. Oh, no. No. Just don't get, let's go! So just FYI, I got 12K, I got in. Yo, what's going on guys? It's March 15th and Skidmore just came out. <sighs> so we're gonna open it right now. <sighs> Maybe a decision letter. Let's go! Let's no. go! <laughs> yeah. Woo! Let's go! Whoa! What you got? <laughs> Green, 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 green. 
Pre St. Patrick's, Patrick's Day. Day. Pre St. Patrick's, Patrick's Day. Day. What's up, guys? It's March 16th, and right now we're going to open up Notre Dame. Oh boy, plug in. I got waitlisted. That's Patty's a Patty's, Patty's Day, Day moment. Patty's, Patty's Day moment. <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? Uh, it's March 17th. I'm back with a remix. Today is Colby. No, you're not Aiden. I'm Aiden. Okay, guys, so we're opening up Colby. Okay. Wait list. No. Oh boy, okay, not bad, not, not bad. bad. What's going on, guys? We are about to open up Williams. Oh boy. Wait list. Oh boy. All around me are familiar faces. Worn out. Is that Ethan Bradbury? Middle. Barry. Barry. What's going on, guys? It's March 18th, and we're about to open Middlebury. Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Open decision. Let's go! What's up guys? We're in the shower. It's March 18th and we are about to open Bates. Bates. Wow. Crazy. Okay. Let's do this. It's March 21st, and we're going to open up Tufts University. Oh boy. Status update. Oh my god! Oh what? my fucking god! Yes! You're so fucking yes! good! Yes! 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 Let's fucking go, dude! Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Wait, is this real? This is real. It just happened. Is this Are real? You you did is it. this fucking real? You did it. Yeah, baby. Woohoo! Yeah. He's in. Turn on the lights. Oh. <laughs> and the lights are back on. Congratulations. Oh, congratulations, dude. That's Get so here. cool. Right on. Bring it. Let's go. Yeah, Bring it. Group hug. Oh my oh. god. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, oh, man. On. Well, I am not faking a reaction, some would. And I'm going to be honest, I just heard back from Northeastern because they have a, uh, pardon my friends, shitty system um, that just automatically gives you their decision. And I got waitlisted, which is, which is pretty funny, which is kind of funny. So, yep, <laughs> that's fun. I'm a bird. <laughs> What's up guys? I'm cosplaying as an eagle and it's March 23rd and I'm about to open up Boston College. Oh boy. Waitlisted. Good job, good job. Good job. <laughs> What's going on guys? It's March 24th and we're about to open up Northwestern. Oh boy. Meow. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my no. god! Oh what? my god! What? 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 I got him! I got him! Yes! Oh my god. Yes, dude! No! 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 No
drops your cane, yo! <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Come on! Let's go! Yes! Let's go! Way to go, yeah, Aiden! Baby, let's go! <laughs> You got it. Yeah, give me an air hug. Oh, yeah. Here. Let's go. There we go. Woohoo. There we go. Air hug. Give her a big hug. Good job. Nice wet hug. Yeah. Number nine. Number nine. Number nine. Woohoo. Be you. Good job. Well put. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, a number six with extra tip, a number seven, two number 45s. One with cheese and a large soap. Oh, he what? In. He did not. He hasn't did he really? He got in. He got in. He, got he in. hasn't seen it yet. He got in. Let's go! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Let's go. Oh yeah! Let's go! What? Oh! Boy. Hey! Hey! Yeah. He got in! Woo. Good, Woo. Job. Good job! Woo. All right! Good job! Oh yeah! Ooh. Amazing! Yes, Not, what is that? Nine and one or ten and ten, one? Ten, 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 five, and one. Ten. Let's go. Let's see your sweatshirt. One. Let's go. Yo, Let's Carnegie. See him, you. Arf, arf. Oh yeah! Arf, arf. Way to go, Aiden! Da, 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 Unbelievable! Da, 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 da. How do you yeah. play that? Three in a row. Scottish you have to learn how to play the bagpipe. Certified Scott. Scott. Yeah. Travis Scott. Travis Scott. Travis Scott moment. Travis Scott. Amogus. Hey, what's going on, guys? What's crack a lacking? It's March thirtieth. We're about to open up Cornell. We're currently standing around in a whole circle of candles, and we have an IVC on the ground, which is kind of hype. So, let's do this. Let's see. Let's do this. Let's see. Let's do this. What let's you got? See. Okay. Uh, the update. Rejected. Ooh. Ooh. Raw Ooh. moment. Sorry. Or no. That's oh, no. L, more like core L. Yo, what's up guys? We're still here. We're still standing here. It's been like three seconds, four seconds, whatever it's been. Right here we have the cat and all of us are standing here and bearing it because we're about to open brown. And we also have a little bit of a B. It's a little bit messed up, kind of looks like an infinity sign, but that's going to be how many acceptances I have. Joking. Anyhow, so, let's do this. What is the question? Hmm? To be? Or not to be. Or not to or be. Not the to question be. is, there we go. Okay, so then the, okay guys. guys. Come on. Ba, 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 ba. Boop, rejected. Rejected. Oh, I guess we're going to bear it again. Not to be. Yeah. LB. But I'm mint! I'm money! I'm an educated gentleman! So join or die, Bill! Cause it's all about the Benjamin! Yo, what's going on, guys? We're about to open our third and final decision for this entire video. Last. Last. UPenn. And as you can see, we have a P on the ground. We're, we are currently pushing P, as Gunna said. But push P. I'll push a P. Hopefully, this goes well. Mr. Benjamin's smiling down Come on me. On, UP. UPenn. Is it pop pop possible? Yep. Could it be pop 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 possible? Okay. Boop, rejected again. Uh, L moment. All right. Alrighty. Okay. Wow. Alrighty. Hey. Good work, boy. You are come hard. to the end. What's going on, guys? I hope you enjoyed all the college decision reactions, and now it's time for the college decision reveal. So, to start off with, we have UNH. Now UNH is a great school. I have uh, some friends that went there, but for me, I just don't think it was the best choice. So we're gonna eliminate. Next, we have UMass Amherst, amazing school. I would actually say one of the best locations out of any schools that I, I applied to. 
However, yet again, I don't think the fit was 100% right. And I think I had options that were more better suited for me specifically. So we're going to eliminate UMass Amherst. So next we have University of Connecticut. University of Connecticut was definitely a very hard one to eliminate. However, the thing about it is I think that it didn't fully fit me as we've said before. The location itself was, was pretty good, uh, but there's a lot of students, uh, not that I wouldn't do well there, but I was a little hesitant. Um, definitely, <laughs> their sports teams as have done very, very, very well and their academics are really great, but I think I just had better options for me. So we're going to eliminate UConn. Next, we have Case Western. Now here's the thing, Case Western sent me so many emails. So to Case Western, thank you. And also not thank you for like blowing up my hard drive. Um, I, again, I think they're a great school, but they're in Ohio, nothing against Ohio at all, but I wasn't, you know, fully sure location wise and uh, academics wise, it, it was really good. But again, I just think just location and everything else, I think there's just a few uh, better suited for me. So we're going to eliminate Case Western. Now, next we have Skidmore. Now, Skidmore is great. Um, definitely a very hard school to let go of. Um, but in this case, it was it was really small. And I, I know I'm applying to a lot of small schools, but with everything considered, I just wasn't sure the small nature of it combined with what they what they offered would be the best for me. Um, so I decided to eliminate them. But thank you so much, Skidmore. I really appreciate it. Okay, so obviously nothing's different about me. I definitely didn't restock anything. But next is going to be Middlebury. Now, I really, 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 really love Middlebury, but there's a little bit of an issue which I didn't fully touch on in the video, which is that I was let in as a Feb, which basically means I had to go if I wanted to in February instead of September. So thank you so much, Middlebury, for uh, you know letting me in. Uh, however, I, that just wasn't a huge option. I just wasn't looking forward to that at all. So for that reason mainly, I will eliminate Middlebury. Now, this is definitely not a Cornell shirt. No, uh, Aiden superimpose it over here. Um, no, next is uh, BU. So BU, great school. Um, I do have to say... Uh, one of the best locations, in my personal opinion, for myself. Um, however, the issue with BU was that uh, it is just like really, really big. Um, nothing against that, but when it came to looking at my other options and just everything that they offered, I think they were just a little bit better for me. But BU, amazing school. Thank you for letting me in. So next up is Bates. Now, I just want to say that Bates was by far the most friendly and welcoming school that I applied to. The admissions letter sounded like it was handwritten and throughout the process, they were so nice in reaching out to me, answering questions, anything like that. So while I think that there's schools that fit me a little bit better, um, thank you so much, Bates. They are an incredible school with incredible people. Um, so I, I'm really uh, lucky that I got to be a part of it, but sadly, I will have to eliminate big. Now next, we have Tufts. Now Tufts um, is incredible. It is you know really close to Boston. However, the last two I think had better programs for me. Tufts was incredible great school but i just don't think the programs um, were just as good in terms of academics so i'll have to eliminate tufts next we have carnegie mellon this was a really 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 difficult choice carnegie mellon is an incredible school um, and their programs their academics their student body everything was incredible um, however, the actual location of it, um, some of the specifics in their programs and just everything in general uh, made me reach a consensus. So I just want to thank Carnegie Mellon. I don't think you'd be watching this, but if you are, um, thank you so much for accepting me into your school. I'm sorry I couldn't accept, which means I'm going with
Northwestern! I chose Northwestern for a multitude of reasons. First of all, I think the location was perfect for me. I think the programs were perfect. I think the whole school culture vibe, the actual number of students there, I think everything pretty much fit. And when I walked on campus, I could basically feel it in my soul. So thank you once again for watching this video. I really hope wherever you are in the college admissions process that everything goes well for you. And just remember that at the end of the day, this is just one part of your life. While it may seem like, you know, watching me or other people get into great colleges is something to aspire to, just know that everyone has a different life path. And just because you get into some fancy college does not necessarily mean that, that you're going to be set up for a great life. Setting aside all the cursedness of this, um, it's been quite the ride. There's been a lot of ups and downs. If you could notice, uh, when I got waitlisted three times, I was going through a pretty rough patch, but got almost instantly uh, back up when I got all those acceptances, essentially back to back to back. So it's been a journey, and I can almost guarantee you, whoever you are, you're probably going to have a journey with this if you haven't already. So just know you'll get through this. There is an end to it. Um, and thank you so much for coming on my journey.